How David Castaneda almost broke Robert Sheehan's nose during filming? Who got into trouble on a plane after drinking too much? And was the cloth removal scene successful? Three, two, one. Hi, I'm Dylan. Buckle up. Number five can write music, but can't dance. We know a lot about Aiden Gallagher being on set because of his regular YouTube vlog. The new Netflix star posted tons of videos where he showed what it looked like behind the scenes. And he also posted lots of his music videos on his channel. Cause as true fans might know, Aiden Gallagher is also a singer and musician. He even wrote music while waiting in his trailer to film. Okay, so here's the chorus. Pretty cool for a 16-year-old kid, right? And his vlog camera never stopped, even on set. How you doing? Are you filming yourself now? Pretty much. Here you can see how long it took to get number five's hair to stay like that. And that Gallagher was even afraid of getting lung cancer from all that hairspray. I'd be afraid too if I were in his place. Anyways, one of our favorite videos from his vlog was David Castaneda teaching Aiden and Emmy how to dance. For some reason, Aiden was a bad student, unlike Emmy, which is kind of crazy, isn't it? I mean, the dude is so talented, and he writes amazing music, but for some reason, he couldn't get the rhythm. Talking about dancing, the cast does a lot of that. Seriously, their social network accounts are full of videos like these. Catering job. Uh, it's really hard work being so hip hop. Dancing was all over the place. And also boomerangs and really weird cast activities. Does anyone have any ideas what the hell Justin Min, AKA Ben is doing in this video? Hey, Everett, right on. If you do, please explain in the comments, cause we're dying to know. If you think that being on set is always about having fun, trust us, actors are just like the rest of us. Sometimes they get sucked into their cell phones. Just look how focused they are. Robert Sheehan behaves like Klaus IRL. Here comes one of the most important questions that Robert Sheehan was asked ever. Tell me, do they give you special underwear so you can get into the character? Cause, admit it, Klaus's style of dressing is indeed extravagant. Sheehan answered that one in his trademark manner. Well, you, you know, for when we first meet Klaus, he's wearing these ridiculous leather pants yeah. that have a sort of a, um, a kind of a lacing all the way right. outside, which goes, you know, right up to my the naked side of my bum bum. Bum bum? Well, that's something new. Of course, in such a case, the actor would need a special type of underwear. Any ideas what those looked like? Sheehan described them better than anyone could possibly do. And yeah, basically flesh-colored sort of budgie smugglers. That's what, uh, that's what, what did you say? Budgie smugglers, you know what I mean? See, he behaves like Klaus, like he's constantly high. If you were ever on drugs, which I never was ever in my life. <laughs> Robert Sheehan is always having fun, joking around, babbling nonsense. Sometimes it's funny. It's nice to come back and be here. Oh shit. They were supposed to fall from my head onto my eyes. Sometimes it's weird. Body of Christ. <laughs> but most of the time, he's just jabbering nonsense. Cause why not? Yeah, uh, we're so hip hop. We're so hip hop that even at uh, even at the promotion of the Umbrella Academy, we got a job in catering. Got a million dollar ring in my e bands. Yes, indeed, sir. God bless. I'm knackered from this catering job. It's really hard work being so hip hop. But that's okay. All right, sir. All right. God bless you. Thank you, sir. Hare Krishna. In his talk with Hey You Guys, Robert drew a penis on the wall behind him and accused the interviewers of doing it. I think it's deeply unprofessional of Hey You Guys to, you know, situate me for an interview, like right in front of a giant cock that they drew. Yeah, you know, that's, that's not fair. That undermines me. It's undermining, okay? I don't like giant purple cocks near my head. <laughs> Typical Klaus, right? 
During an MTV International interview session, the cast played the game Who Said That? and soon after the game changed to Who Did That? The actors were asked the same question, who once got into trouble on a plane after drinking too much? And everybody named the same actor without even thinking about it. Robert Sheehan. Of course it's Robbie. <laughs> oh really? Yeah, that was me. You want to hear this story? Of course you do! Drunk Robert Sheehan gets into trouble. Okay, this story happened years ago before filming The Umbrella Academy, but it's definitely worth mentioning, because it explains why Sheehan is so convincing playing Klaus. Boom bam ba doom bam release. Some time ago, Robert went to Toronto to audition for a role in the Mortal Instruments. And of course, he found a new friend there, who was also auditioning for the same movie. They partied together for almost a week, which is nothing for Sheehan, right? Every man has limits. Yeah. <laughs> That's right, Robert. They flew back home on the same plane, and they were already very drunk before boarding. Like, things could be any different. But Sheehan wouldn't be Sheehan if he didn't take a bottle of whiskey with him on the plane, cause what else should they do on their way home? Apparently, the stewardesses were not impressed at all. Oh! They asked for our passports and said they were reporting us for being wasted, remembers Robert laughing. The annoying thing was that they confiscated the whiskey during the flight, and when I got it out a few weeks later to celebrate getting the part, I realized they'd poured salt in to ruin it. Oh. Ah! <laughs> See kids, this is what happens if you get drunk on a plane. We won't describe all the consequences Sheehan faced, let's just say he learned a big lesson from it. Most of you are gonna really, really hate me for this, but you know what, fuck you guys, because I'm a person too. No, I'm only joking. Wanna hear a story about when Castaneda punched Sheehan in the face and almost broke his nose? Wait for it folks, it's coming soon. Tom Hopper being truly number one. The guy is simply amazing, both on the show and once the camera turns off. Seriously, he looks cool even just sitting in front of lights. You can see how much the Umbrella Academy cast and crew loves Hopper in this sweet video, where they congratulate him on his B-Day. Happy birthday, dear Tom. Happy birthday to you. And he has enough power in his lungs to blow out two sets of candles. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You want to see what his training for walking on the moon looked like? Here it is. Pretty cool, huh? Besides for acting and fighting, the thing that Tom Hopper does the best on set is mess around. Uncle Brit. <laughs> But you know who wasn't spotted fooling around on set? Keep watching to find out. Now, let's talk about another crazy on-set incident. Castaneda punched Sheehan in the face! Yes, that's what happened during filming one of the scenes. Castaneda headbutted Sheehan in the face and almost broke his nose. Was it accidental or on purpose? Let's find out. The incident happened during filming the scene where Klaus saves Diego from being shot by Cha-Cha and Hazel. How ironic, right? It was a pretty intense scene for Sheehan, especially if you take into account that earlier that day, he was playing really drunk Klaus. Like, vodka drunk. And at the end of his hardest day is Klaus's most heroic scene from season one. And what does he get for it? A headbutt in the face. Ouch. Castaneda said they were cool afterwards and they even ate sushi together. So it looks like everything was fine and it was just an accident. Or Castaneda really wanted Sheehan to shut up for a while and found his own way to do it. And what about Ellen Page? What was she up to while the camera wasn't rolling? When she wasn't getting sucked into her phone, she was singing in a very cool way. Check this out. Shower, I will scour, I will run. Find a peace of mind, the happy mind. The weird thing about Paige is that she wasn't spotted doing any funny things on set, except for maybe one lone video. Bunny! <laughs> I found a little bunny. bunny. I don't, oh, there's my buddy. buddy. <laughs> oh, my buddy works now. Buddy! <laughs>
but seriously, Ellen Page can hardly be seen fooling around on set. Like she's a true professional! Or like she's an ordinary, normal person who will later become a merciless supervillain. That's for you to decide. Thank you guys for watching this video. Subscribe to our channel, and as always, thanks for staying awesome. Oh, I almost forgot. I promised to tell you if the cloth removal was successful. A romantic cloth removal. Three, two. And the correct answer is... No, of course not. <laughs> and what did you expect? Robert Sheehan's definitely not the right person for a trick like that.